More than 6 million adults in the United States have heart failure, a chronic condition where the heart is not able to pump enough blood and oxygen to the body. But there may be hope for people who have sudden or beginning to have gradual symptoms of heart failure thanks to a new treatment just done in the U.S. for the very first time. After months of struggling with shortness of breath, Robert Dye knew something was wrong. I couldn't lay flat on my back because I couldn't breathe at night. In October, he was admitted to the hospital and diagnosed with acute decompensated heart failure. Cardiologists at the Ohio State University Richard M. Ross Heart Hospital say the 65-year-old is the first patient in the U.S. to get a new type of treatment for it. I can actually feel my heart beating in my chest, which I wasn't able to do before. A catheter was placed through a vein in his neck and into Dye's heart, where electrodes were used to stimulate a nerve. Doctors say early studies show this can increase how strong the heart beats to pump more blood without significantly raising a patient's heart rate. By increasing the amount that the heart is naturally doing, we can then start to repair his heart using medications and other treatments that we have available. Dr. Sita Marish Amani and his team performed Dye's investigative procedure. While the treatment is still being studied, he says this could be a huge step forward in helping heart failure patients. Traditional therapies aren't well designed to increase the amount of blood flow from the heart. The couple that we do have out there have a lot of side effects. Days after the procedure, before leaving the hospital, Dai says he was able to walk a mile. It gave me a second chance of life. If it hadn't been done, I wouldn't be here today. A chance at more time with his great grandchild. All right, so right now the clinical trial is expected to continue for the next couple of years at the Ohio State Wexner Medical Center. After that, doctors hope to expand the trial to become more of a standard therapy.